Hello, hello, hello. Welcome back to Exotic Wine Travel. I'm your host, Matthew Horky. So we're here in Cyprus for two weeks on a press trip, tasting through some of the wineries in Cyprus. And this is the first winery that we've been to where we've been impressed with the entire line. The wines have been consistent the whole way through. Uh, we're at San Garidas Winery. Uh, we're actually close to the city of Paphos. This is their Zinisteri from 2016. The Zinisteri is the local white grape uh, here in Cyprus. I'm really, you know, I'm really high on this grape because some of the wineries you've been to haven't been the most impressive overall, but their Sinisteri is always good, so it tells me a lot about the potential of the grape. Uh, the San Garidas one, this was just bottled, and the beautiful thing about this, with, with Sinisteri, I get so much pine. That's the thing that I get the most. This has a little bit more lemon-lime, kind of a green mango nose to it. Anything else else that you pick up on it, Shireen? Correct. Any, that's, that's, that's everything was? There's a bit of minty notes to it as well, without the menthol. There's some mint, exactly, some menthol. And the cool thing about this Sinisteri... It's very mineral-driven, long end palate. I mean, I had this at 4.1. That was a very good wine, right? They make some uh, another... Indigenous local variety, Marathetico. This is from 2015, aged six months in new French oak. They also make a Matado, 2015. This was very, very, very much like a Spanish Matado. Shireen really enjoyed this. One thing that I was really impressed with, this is my highest scored wine of theirs, very limited edition. This is the Shiraz from 2010. To me, it tasted very much like a Barossa Shiraz, maybe a little bit leaner. I still got the black pepper, uh, the black pepper, the blackberry, the graphite, maybe a little bit of red berry as well. Anything else that you picked up on I this? Got black cherry. Black cherry as well. Yeah, it's very juicy, very ripe fruit in the mouth. The tannins. The tannins are drinkable. They're ripe. It's not as heavy as a Barossa Shiraz. It's just really nice. So I'm impressed overall. This winery is uh, striving to be 100% organic. They have organically certified vineyards, but since they also buy grapes from local farmers, not all their wines are organic. The, the Matara Marathaftico, these are 100% certified organic. So really good stuff. Anything else you want to add on this winery? Uh, I think there are only, I think, two organic uh, wineries. Yes. And in Cyprus, so if you're interested to come here. It's something that worth checking out. So uh, I'll put this the link in the description box. Guys, if you like this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, Exotic Wine Travel. I will see you at the next episode.